This is Ira Glass of This American Life. I was interviewed on Stephen Colbert's new TV show a couple weeks ago. Okay, actually, it was just a practice show that he and his staff did as they got ready to take over David Goldman's new time slot. They did a bunch of practice shows that they didn't broadcast. That's how famous I am. I got on the practice shows. Anyway, at one point, our conversation turned to the subject of public radio fundraising. And um, well, Like for the pledge drive. Through the pledge drive. Right. Well, I like the pledge drive. You like the pledge drive? No, because I feel needed. <laughs> Because when I'm listening to the shows, it's like I'm sort of eavesdropping on like cool people talking about stuff. But when they actually go to the mic and say, would you please send us money? It's like my wife, my wife has said like, I can't believe you like the pledge drive. And I'm like, no, the pledge drive is like my secret girlfriend. She wants me <laughs> around all the time. So I feel very needed. It's like when I was years, when I was very lonely, I would listen to the pledge drive and just say, <sighs> Someone's willing to spend, you know, spend the night with me and beg me for money. <laughs> you know, I think he's right. I think public radio wants to be more than just friends, which I know sounds a little creepy, but I don't mean that in the creepy way. I think when he says the pledge drive is your secret girlfriend, there is a point to it, which is I think your relationship with public radio is different than your relationship with, you know, commercial radio or network TV or just all that other stuff. All of us here on public radio are trying every day to truly give you things you cannot get from anybody else. And we need you in a way none of those other places do. And on public radio, those things go hand in hand. And sometimes we need you to do your part in our relationship. So take a second now and give.